we got a lot of people listening to our show internationally and domestically. So we thank you for that, for writing with us. Check out our Patreon. That's where we make some real paper, no ads. We try to be anti-formulaic. We bring entertaining, thought-provoking, and informative content with a lot of love opposing points of view. It enlightens us. We don't shy or stray away from it or stop talking to them because they have a different opinion. Uh, you can find that at K-O-N-N-A-N.me. That's where you can find all the extra audio and video that didn't fit on the show, including musical segments where in a, we, we get members from the round table and we break down a favorite band or artist in our top five songs. So each person has to pick a, a song, their top five of that art, artist. Uh, cannot coincide with another person so we keep it fresh and you give a little story of why you like it um and why you like the band and all that it's incredible um if you like everything from prince to tupac you know the led zeppelin the rolling stones the casey and the sunshine band there's a group there go check it out who doesn't like music boom we also do uh take no prisoners approach we got no dog in the hunt we don't care we don't want people to do bad. We just critique what we see. We critique um, SmackDown, Raw, and Dynamite. I've actually been watching NXT every week and Impact and Collision and, and Rampage. Listen to the main wow. event in Rampage, and they wonder why. And I'd like to hear the rating if you have it, Joe. Can you give me the rating for Rampage? Yes. That was on Friday. Mm-hmm. I know you're multitasking, Disco, but are you listening? Yeah, the rating, we're looking for okay, the Rampage okay. rating. Okay. Yeah. okay, all right, all right, all right. Yeah. Here we go. I don't think Rampage right. is out. Is it out? Yep. Um, Rampage, 233,000. It's dropped 43% from a year prior. Uh, it's lost 50% of its 2022 audience. So Okay, that. so that's my point. This is yeah. the main event. This is You're trying to get people to watch a show and come back the next week. You ready? Right, right. Both both good wrestlers, okay? But it's not all about good wrestling. Jimmy Utah versus Shibata. Come okay, on. that's Wheeler. First of all, it's Wheeler Utah. Because you keep mistaking him for bad. Jimmy Yang. Right. Yeah. <laughs> you keep <laughs> and uh and Shibata versus Wheeler Utah. Utah. <laughs> Why do you correct me? Have fun at my expense because and, well, I that, would review with you. Well, that yeah. match was made on dynamite. <clears throat> Remember when right. Shibata and those guys were doing the interview? The Wheeler Utah um, busted the interview. Remember? All right. Unless they were going to do this on top of the Empire State Building and get a buzz out of it, who was going to watch that, bro? Just because they did it on Dynamite. Small. I mean, uh, yeah, New Japan fans. Yeah, but Japanese that's a very. Legend. I, I understand that, Joe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not being facetious. Mm -hmm. That we. It's already been proven for four years. That's a very small niche. And they're already there. How many times must we say this? And I've uh -huh. heard other guys say it too, like Billy Ray. Oh. I respect his opinion. Jim Cornette, I respect his opinion. I think Vince Russo probably said it at one time. No, Disco? Everybody says it. Okay, dude. They, un they under-deliver right? on what they could be putting on TV. I don't know, I don't know what they're saving stuff for. Right. Well, like, why are they saving stuff that's never, that they never, never happened? You know, there's so many or stuff that isn't main event worthy, bro. You're trying, right. you're fighting with other channels. You're fighting with, do I finish my Halo game or what Zelda, right. or whatever they're playing now? Or do I watch this match? You know, right. I don't know. As we'll dig into later with the punk thing. I mean, think about it. We're talking about the lack of star power on shows and stuff like that. And in the last uh, year and a half, they've lost their two biggest male stars, arguably in their history. And the woman they are pushing to be their biggest female star. So I'm not doom and gloom, but right. I, think, people, I don't think it's going to improve anytime are, soon. Yeah. Oh, because people are like, what am I doing here? I, I think I'd do better somewhere else. Yeah. So I, I watch all the shows, bro, now. 